Are we in a fighting spirit? Yes. Are we in a fighting spirit? Yes. Not good enough, guys. Are we in a fighting spirit? Yes. Exactly. We, get, we need to get this thing done. We need to win this election. We need to win this election because the world is changing too fast if we sit still. We need to be thinking about the next generation. We need to be thinking about the fact that the world is running out of its resources. We need to be thinking about the fact that there's a huge backlash based on nostalgia, based on reactionary politics. If that wave continues, we will see women stripped of their rights in more and more countries. If that wave continues, we will see our children and the youngest generation stripped of a good future. We stand in between that wave and the future. We will not play the game of rewriting the past. We will write the future. And we can only do that if we can get people out to vote. We can only succeed in May if you succeed in convincing people to vote. If you succeed in convincing women that this is about their position, about their rights, if you can, if you can really convince them that the ones who are going to be, pay the biggest price for this reactionary backlash are women and young people, it only takes them half an hour to go out and vote. It will take you more time, more energy, more determination, going door to door, doing everything you can on social media to get them out to vote. But I know you can. I depend on you. We as a movement depend on you. But it's time. It's time that we said no more austerity. It's time that we said fair taxes. Everybody pays taxes, even the biggest corporations in the world should pay taxes where they make profits. They're not doing that now. We're going to take care of that. It's time. It's time that housing is going to be organized in a way so that young people have a future that is beyond staying at their parents' home forever. It's time that we create affordable housing everywhere in all the major cities. Europe can do that together with our member states, together with our municipalities, together with our regions. It's time we started doing that. And it's time we initiated this huge, epic transformation of our society into a sustainable society. It's time that our economy became a sustainable economy, a circular economy. It's time that we take plastics out of the oceans. It's time that we renovate our educational system so that everybody can keep learning and that the jobs that will be coming will be available for everyone. And most of all, it's time that Europe reconnected with its fundamental values, which are human rights, the rule of law, and true democracy. You're going to do that. I'm sure you are. Every single one of you is going to talk to dozens of other people, and you'll inspire them with what you've learned here today. You'll inspire them with your energy. And then we will surprise everyone at the end of May with the result we can get. The time has come for us. The time has come to campaign. It's time to win. Thank you very much and good luck.